Hello friends, welcome to this tutorial and here I'm going to be showing you how you could use Ansible Playbook to start, to stop or terminate EC2 instances you have running on the Amazon Cloud. Now, for us to start this tutorial, you need to have uh, EC2 instances running on your Amazon uh, Web Cloud. If you don't know how to start that, it's really easy from your console, you could just launch an EC2 instance here. Or you could go to my previous video and see how we use the playbook to start an EC2 instance and just follow that details. Um, you just get your um, your your instances running. Now let's go to the Power Playbook and let's see how we could use playbook to actually start or stop instances. First, we need to define uh, the host web server in our playbook. Then the tags we are basically gonna be running we only need some parameters here number one we need to have the region where the ec2 uh, instance is running and i have here is us east one it could be different from yours like here these my two instances running here i have us east one a and the other one us east one uh yes us east one a now the next parameter we need is the instance id this instance ID specifies the particular instance that is actually running. We need this to reference to know the playbook to know which instance is actually going to start or which instance is actually going to stop. So from here, uh, let's just pick out one instance here. We have this one, and let's say let's pick out the let's pick out the second instance. Oh, hold up. Yeah, okay, now let's pick up the second instance. We have three instances running here oh wow okay let's pick out this instance um all we have to do is first to copy the instance id then we'll copy the instance id we'll go over to our yaml file and we'll place the instance id right in between uh a quote between between two uh braces then we need to specify the state of the instance. The state of the instance can be either it's running, which is an instance that's running, uh, either it's a stopped, which is a uh, reference to what we are gonna do to stop the instance, or, or it's absent, which means to terminate the instance. So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna say, since we have the instances running already, uh, we're gonna say stopped, and this is actually going to stop our instance. So we're going to copy this YAML file that we see here. We're going to copy this YAML file. I already have uh, it. Then we'll go over to our console. Then we uh, we open a we open a an editor. I use I usually use uh, Nano. Let me see now. Let's do this. I use nano, um, nano terminate. Okay, yes, nano terminate. Now this is our code here. It says here web server. Yeah, the main thing we need here is the the region US is one, and this is our instance ID. Now we have to make sure our instance ID corresponds to the instance right here. Let's see. This is our F four one. We have three instances running. Yes. Okay, so we are going to be terminating this instance right here. So it could be different for you. Um, and the state is going to be, we're changing the state right here. We're going to change it to start. Means we're stopping the instance. And let's say, yeah. And the name is stop my server instance. So let's save this. And let's run the playbook. Okay, let's run the playbook. Um, terminate dot yaml. Let's run the playbook. Now it says here. It was done successfully so let's go back to our instance and see what happened okay we we're trying to terminate this instance here f1 okay 
let's refresh the page and see okay as you can see this instance is stopping okay it's stopping after a while you're gonna see that it stopped all right so um let's run the code to see let's see how we can uh, uh what are we gonna do to start the instance again what we need to do to start the instance again we just need to change the state to running and that's it uh we'll go back to our console we'll do a nano uh nano terminate we need to change this over to running uh let's see change the name to hold on change the name to start start my server instance let me save it and we'll run it again let's see if our instance has stopped okay so these are instances successfully stopped uh, let's run it again and see run it again okay okay the instance is should be running right now so let's go back to our instance let's refresh the page and we can see the changes the state is changing to pending uh, very soon it's gonna be running it's initializing so usually it takes about a couple of minutes or so or more for you to you know start running the game uh, so if we want to finally terminate the instance all we need to do is uh, change the state to absent and the instance is gonna terminate so let's go back here now the now the instance is it's running now the instance is running the instance is running okay let's go back to our console let's do our nano uh, and change it to we're terminating the the name the name parameter doesn't really mean much it's just what appears on uh, it shows you the tax you're running and helps you keep track of what actually you're doing as you're following the output um, so right here we're going to change the state from running to terminate no not terminate sorry to absent this tells it you save it so let's let's first of all let's see uh, the status of our instance it's still initializing let's just give it a, a little while maybe let me refresh this refresh the and see because i want it to be running fully give it a little while and see if what's going on okay you know what let's specify another instance uh let's try to stop another instance let's leave that one and let's copy this instance id we'll copy this instance id we'll go back to um terminal change the instance id right here we'll paste this new one in here we'll save yes and let's run this playbook let's see okay good so refresh the skin the screen now you see the instance is shutting down okay the instance is shutting down so that's how you could start stop or terminate uh, an instance in uh, using the playbook. Thank you very much for this tutorial. See you again next time.